this is how long it is now. And go back. And now I'm going to cut it, demonstrate to you. Don't recommend this at home. Okay. going for a layer look so I'm going to I always use this fine tooth comb when I cut my own hair and come back almost into a ponytail like using that fine comb Gets all those little hidden hairs that aren't normally you probably wouldn't get. And then you comb up. It's literally almost a ponytail that you make. Aha! Ponytail. If you have longer hair, like me. And then pull it like a trail doll literally I can't even reach the end it's already scary as crap I know and we're going to come on bring it down like this but see if you pull it up it's still like that but I'm going to bring it down and it's a pretty good lot more than I wanted. So good. That's what happens. Probably enough to donate actually. Okay. I'm going to show you what the back looks like. It's going to kind of be in a V. See? Got my layers. But my back that all right now we got some layers now I'm just gonna do a little sideways things and the way I do them is I part it way over to the opposite side sideways things y'all Part it way over to the opposite side. I grab about this much. Pam the rest back. Now what you want to do, because I'm going to be, I want my things to swoop that way. I'm going to pull it way over here. Like this. And then I'm going to cut it straight across while I'm pulling it over this way. And then when it goes over, it's going to be a side swoop bang. Pull it way over. Okay, I'm going to go about right there. Cut. Okay. So I'll pull way over and cut straight across. And now when I let go. And then go over here. It makes it sideways bang. See, that goes down. So now we've got layers and sideways bangs. So now, when we curl our hair, we'll have some volume. So I'm going to curl it. Let you see how it looks. I already like it. It's already way lighter. Got volume now. Put 
Okay, next I just used my hot rollers. Done a quick little roll up just to give it some volume, you know. So I'm gonna let these sit for about 30 minutes. All right, here we go. Now these are big hot rollers that really don't curl that good. That's actually a very good curl for them. It just kind of gives you some volume. Just a little volume. I'm actually excited to have a different look. I've just been long and lanky and bleh for so long. I'm going to give a little poof to myself tonight. Let's see. I'm trying to remember which one I put in first. And as I take these out, I just kind of do a little... See how I twist that out? That's how you get those babies out. Try to take out the ones I put in first, first. The ones I put in last, last. Wow, my hair might actually hold some curl now since it don't have all that weight. Which it probably would have before. I just never tried. Never had time to. <coughs> I'm just dropping my curlers and the little things into the sink. Getting some baba woo, baba woo. Come out, come out, come out. Okay, feels like I still have one in. I do some more so I can feel it pulling me. Under here somewhere. There it is. Okay. I'm going to show you a little Kentucky secret. Might not even be a secret. Oh, yeah. I only use Tresemme on my hair for stalling. Take the hair after you take it out, flip it upside down, spray up underneath, shake. And then spray all them curls. It's getting thick in here. Next. Moose. And it's Tresemme. I just like to take a big galoop. Flip my hair upside down. Put it up under the back part. And just shake it up in there. It's going to give it some volume. It's going to separate it. If I don't do that, I'm telling you, I don't have much volume. Now you've seen I've not done anything except take the rollers out, little hairspray moves, and I'm going to show you what it's looking like already. It's everywhere. But it's got some, some curl. So, next, I'm going to... Start back here. I love these little combs. I'm sorry. I know a lot of people don't even keep these combs, but I do. I like to start as far back as I can. At least make sure you go back to where your hair parts back behind that a little bit. Right there. What you're going to do to give you a southern poof. Just going to pull that baby up. Pull it towards you. Right behind it. Take 
a little cone. Give it some teasy, teasy, tease. Don't be afraid. You're going to cover that, so it really don't matter how that's going to look. Now, take you another part. If you want it to be a higher poof, you don't take as much. See how much I took? If you want it to be a higher poof that's got more up, up there, then you just take a little bit, a little bit, a little bit at a time until you get to the front. I don't want a big high poof. I just want a little poof. It was hard to do in film, y'all. I had no idea how hard YouTubers had it. They make it look so easy, some of them do. So I just sprayed it, now I'm teasing it. See? Okay. See how it's starting to poof? Get my little, um, I forgot her name. The lady off the nanny look. Oh my goodness, I love her style. Leopard print, the poofy hair, the high heels. I love Fran off the nanny. Fran, Fran, that's her name. All right, so you see this? This is gonna be her top part. So we're not gonna hardly put any teas in it because that's what's gonna cover all of her beehive up by. So we're just going to go one, two, three, just a few. Look at that. Yeah, I see that. Okay, so now we're just going to take the comb. Look at that. Bring it down and around. Bring some of that down and around. See? How this fell and went. Now I need to bring this over to here. And then I'm just going to do that. I'm going to switch my hairspray to number two. Which is a smooth. I've been using the number four. Switching to a smooth is I want to be able to pick my bangs up. If I decide to use that number four, honey, you're not going to be picking that up. It's going to be stiff. And all I've got to do is just slightly move it around. Turn around and show you the back. See? Now, I'm dying to hear all these crazy comments I'm going to get about cutting my own hair. Let me know. Subscribe, like, comment. I want to know. I want to know what you think. You think I'm nuts? It's fine. But, not too shabby. I like it. I got some volume again. And if I think in a few days it looks a little bit too out of whack, I'll go to a salon. And if I do, I'll bring you with me. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Have a good night.